Scorpio, you got stuff jumping out. Okay, so we got the endurance and the um, honesty card. Okay, so this makes me feel like this is not for everybody. I do feel like some of you guys are um, just being honest about a situation that you can't take anymore. Okay, mm. you can't take anymore. Yeah, so you're thinking about leaving. All right. Oh, wow. Yes, yeah, so I do feel like somebody think about leaving and going home. I do feel an energy of um, maybe a different state, a different country, a different uh, somewhere <laughs> just across the world, okay? I do feel like somebody just feel like they just can't, like somebody's like, I can't take this no more. Okay, that's the energy. All right, but the cards I'm using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I'm closing off with my Animal Totem Tarot by Lisa Robertson. Okay, for some of you guys, I do feel like somebody keeps trying to bring new people into your relationship, okay? So I do feel like somebody trying to have a polyamorous relationship, and you don't want that, okay? Um, or this could be someone possibly. Of course, this isn't for everybody may have um had children outside of the relationship and i just feel like somebody was just like okay that's it like i didn't let you do so much stuff but this is it okay all right what's going on with the scorpio 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 what's going on what's going on All right, so we got the presence card here. So I do feel like with this situation, you are getting gifts and things, okay? Um, I do feel like good things are coming to you, okay? I'm going to just try to cut off what I've seen before. So I do feel like gifts and presents are coming, okay, or here. Okay, so this could mean a lot of things, so I'm going to pull another card first. Okay, yeah, so I do feel like somebody's emotionally exhausted by the situation and they're getting ready to move out. Okay, it's just like I'm going up and down and back and forth, you know. I just can't be here. I can't keep doing this, okay. Somebody's just beat. I feel it. Somebody's beat by the whole situation. All right, so we got the soul cage card here. Um, so I do feel like at one point you may have thought this person was a soulmate or this person thought this about you. Um, but I do feel like it's not. This person is not a soulmate. Okay. This person is taking you into a negative mindset, a negative place in life. And I feel like you know that and that's why you are getting ready to move away, you know. But at one point you did feel like, hey, this is my soulmate. All right, yes, same card again. Somebody's going back home, different state, different town, different country, okay? Somebody's headed out. Somebody feels like this, whatever this thing, and I do feel like it was fun and beneficial at first. I do feel like somebody is getting things from it, but I do feel like somebody feelings got more involved and I do feel like somebody did not know that their feelings weren't completely in there, okay? So I do feel like when somebody's feelings got completely in the relationship, they start disliking all the other people. I, I'm not going to say jealousy because it's just like somebody start realizing that I don't want to share my person, okay? I don't want to share anymore, okay? It got old real quick. Okay, it wasn't quick, but it got old. But somebody feelings start coming up. Yes. Okay, so I do feel like when somebody feelings start coming into the situation, um, they also start realizing that the love and the feelings were not coming back to them. Okay. Um, yeah, I do feel like that's when somebody felt like it's time to get out. I do feel like somebody feels like I feel restrained. I feel trapped. And I do feel like somebody just wanting, wanting to get out of this situation, this life.
Yep, so we got the endurance reverse. So yeah, somebody has had all they can have. Sorry, I gotta move this over. I'm sorry, guys. It's just I'm near sighted in one eye and far sighted in the other one. So it's like nothing's ever right. <laughs> ever. It'll be right for two seconds. Close my eyes and open them and it's wrong again. Okay. Um, yeah, but somebody just can't take whatever this situation is anymore. Okay. I do feel like somebody is uh, growing cold on the inside. And I do feel like love is, is, is coming, going toward this situation, but not coming back. Okay. And somebody's realizing that. All right, yeah, so I do feel like somebody is um, second-guessing themselves. What did I do? Why did I make this decision? Why did I, I, I put myself in this relationship, okay? I do feel like it was all fun at first, and then somebody start catching feelings, which is that is what you do, okay, when you're in a relationship. But it's just like, uh, okay, I thought I liked you. I thought I loved you already. But when that love really developed, that's when it was like, I don't want anybody else around you. I don't want what we have here. We're going to have to change some stuff. And I do feel like the other person just wasn't willing to change stuff, okay? Or isn't, okay? And this is what's causing or, or creating that, um, I got to get out of here feeling for you, okay? But this could be the other way around. All right, what's going on with the, ooh. All right, let's see what that is. So we got the chariot card reversed. Somebody is um, taking their time, but we got the five of swords. I do feel like somebody's going to leave out of the blue. And I do feel like somebody's going to leave out of, of the blue because they feel overburdened by everything, by the situation. Um, then we got the knight of wands. So I do feel like somebody's getting ready to leave this situation and move forward. But I do feel like somebody's dragging their feet because they want to see some change, okay? But I do feel like somebody's still planning to leave. But they're just waiting for somebody to say the right thing or do the right thing to keep them from leaving, to keep them from moving, okay? Um, but I do feel like that that is not going to come in time, okay? For some of you guys, it's not going to come in time. Uh, not actually, for like at least 90%, those true actions are not going to happen in time. Okay, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. All right, there it is again. All right, somebody moving. Okay, I do feel like somebody's trying to do it in the most calm and peaceful way. Um, I do feel like somebody's just going to be like, hey, uh, I'm going to explain to you how I feel and see what you do about it. Wait around a couple of days, maybe a week, and I do feel like somebody's going to disappear if they don't get the answer they want, okay? So we got the magician card here. So I do feel like somebody feels like they weren't successful um, or there possibly may be a little bit of manipulation surrounding the whole situation. Uh-oh. So we got the high priestess here. Um, this makes me feel like some kind of uh, secret is being held by someone, okay? Um, if this is not a secret, I do feel like it, I mean, if it's not just the relationships behind your back, I do feel like it could be pregnancies being um, hidden, but I do feel like whatever this is, is getting ready to come out, okay? Um, but I do feel like for some of you guys, someone may try to impregnate you or get pregnant by you um to keep you around so be careful about that okay they want to keep their pet okay so we got the lover's card here mm, mm, mm. so this makes me feel like somebody wants a choice to be made okay somebody wants a choice to be made do you want this person or do you want me Okay, so I do feel like whatever this other person is, it it was known that this other person was around. It wasn't wasn't a secret. I think only thing that could be a secret is a pregnancy there. Okay. All right, so we got the justice card here. So I do feel like.
I do feel like somebody's looking for a choice, looking for balance. I do feel like it's coming. But I also feel like everything is happening the way it's supposed to. I do feel like with this wisdom card reversed here, that it's like somebody got into a relationship not realizing that their feelings was going to get into it, okay? And then now that somebody's feelings are into it, it's just like a, a sort of almost like karma, like why, why you think you can get in a relationship and not feel, okay? So those feelings are coming, all right? So we got this nine of pentacles here. So I do feel like I do feel like somebody may be getting a new thing, okay? I do feel like this might be the person that's moving. That secret That secret is that I'm, I'm leaving, okay? And I also feel like this leaving person, I do feel like be careful because there may be a pregnancy there, okay? Um, but if not, I do feel like somebody's just hiding this that they're getting ready to leave, okay? Hiding that they're leaving. All right, so with this choice, I do feel like somebody was not choosing fast enough, okay? I do feel like it created a little bit of anger, and then I do feel like that is what pushed those just like the cherry on top. I'm out of here, okay? All right, that go another travel card, okay? So we got the three of wands reversed here, so I do feel like somebody is not feeling like they're getting what they want from this situation, and they're leaving two people behind and going to be um, back home, okay? Wherever back home is, somebody is getting ready to go there, all right? But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.